get the one part for this field because I'm doing this in custom games and I disabled mini bosses. But it's pretty easy to explain. So now I'll notice the key. The only way to get the key is if you kill Brutus. If you don't know what Brut who Brutus is, it's that big zombie monster that chooses after you. Um, and once you kill him, he drops a blue item, uh, like a little drop, but instead of green, it's blue. And then, and then you hold spur on it, and it's the key. That's the first item. And then the second item, you want to look to the afterlife box. And then if you you want to look for one that's all like blue around it. This you feels like something it, that should not it's be like touching. A liquid divinium. But alone keeping in pocket is if you kill Brutus. And if you don't know Brutus, just show him up or something. And now this is the last part right here. Door used to lock and that, those are all the parts. Now maybe it will um, keep all pigs out. So yeah, you just need to look for the afterlife. <laughs> the afterlife box, you don't know what afterlife box is. Just skip the video backwards so you know what the afterlife box is. And then you have to see it with this charming blue or you know this blue thing. And you get part. And once you have that part, uh you can you go over there where I was just was and you get that shield part. And then there you go, you just go to a crafting crafting bench, there's one in the docks, you go to a crafting bench, and you make it and then you get yourself a shield. Hopefully this video was good for you. Um and yeah, hopefully you guys watched the uh, uh, Redeemer video. Uh, I'm gonna do a video about how to get the the Blunder guy. Blunder guy, right? Yeah, Blunder guy.